up? What's, what's your name, man? Ah, uh, Fumio. Okay, so we got the Z77 motherboard here. We found the Asus booth. <laughs> Uh, now, what's new uh, with the uh, Z77 motherboard? So, Z77, we actually implement some of the key features that right. what we learned from X79, we actually move it onto Z77 as well. So, one of the key improvements is uh, digital power face design on right. the RAM as well. So, DGVRM so, everywhere. Yeah, DGVRM on CPU, iGPU, since you know, new CPU right. or Sandy Bridge has iGPU. Right. And the thirdly is an uh, improvement on the RAM uh, frequency as well. So now you're doing DigiVRM on RAM? Yes, that is correct. Awesome. So you have better overclocking, better enhancement on your uh, on your system and stability as well. Right. And then uh, you also mentioned something about Asus doing their own caching, so it's not like Intel's caching? What yes. are you guys doing? That's differently. Uh, so Intel uh, has its own SSD caching right. by their chipset, but then we, again, this is the same feature from X79. We, we also provide it onto our Z77 motherboard as well. Right. Uh, so instead of having, you know, RAID, go into BIOS, set up the RAID, and, you know, how to install Intel's, you know, uh, uh, additional step just to enable SSD caching. What we did was that all you have to do is connect the SSD and a hard drive in that particular uh, dedicated port, yeah. and you just hit init initialize inside the OS. Now, Intel has also has a maximum capacity for SSD caching, but right. instead of that, you know, limitation with 18 gigabyte minimum or right. maximum 64, you have uh, unlimited. You could set one gigabyte, two gigabyte, 100 gigabyte worth of SSD as a caching as well. So right. we, we get more flexibility and user-friendly uh, uh, on setting up the SSD caching. Just now, with the SSD caching, can you can you tell the computer to use like only half of the uh, SSD drive for caching and yeah. the other half for storage? Yeah, exactly. So you, you, you could make a partition, again. Right. Windows offer that, you know, easy to use, uh, you buy the you know, volume from like right. this, this dedicated volume is only for four gig, and you could assign that partition to be you know, used as an SSD caching while remaining uh, right. SSD capacity can be used as full SSD performance. Again, the whole point of SSD caching is to uh, improve your mechanical hard drive. Uh, when you know you could have that big storage, but at the same time, maybe improve a little bit of read or write, uh, you could right. use that as part of the SSD partition to help you with that. So when's it going to be out? Uh, Z77, it'll be out on April 8th. We'll be back, and we're going to uh, we can have this one, right? You said we could we can take this one home, right? Uh, we'll see about that. You gotta find the Easter egg, so. I gotta find the Easter egg. Yeah, we have a special promotion going on right now with the Easter egg. If you find the Easter egg, you can win this motherboard. What are we doing here? We're gonna go find the Easter egg. <laughs>